<laughs> Welcome back. Man, it's an action-packed show today. We were just talking about local artists with uh, Heidi and Randy. Now we'd like to feature some amazing local artists. Please welcome John Rakowski, abstract painter. Is that Rusty? No, Rusty. Oh, Rusty. Rusty Lindsay. I'm so sorry. I'm reading the prompter, and I apologize. <laughs> Rusty and Rashad Taylor, a photographer. I'm just reading what's That's written okay. sometimes. You never know. <laughs> uh, local artists who you can see this weekend on C Street. Um, okay, first, can we start with Rashad? Rashad, you're okay. standing closer to yes. me. Okay. And your photo, I'm going to move that over here because I want to feature your work. Yeah, let me Tell us about your photographer. Tell us about your work. Yeah, um, so my work is really a lot of documentary work on my son. Um, it's a series that I'm working on right now. is a long-form series called Little Black Boy, and it kind of just documents him as he grows up black in the United States. Um, we recently moved to Springfield, Missouri, and uh, yeah, I've been photographing him for about five years. There now. is a glare, my friend. I'm oh. just going to move it because I want you there to see There we go. Okay, here, I can hold it. There this. we go. Perfect. Sorry about that. You're good. Look how beautiful that is. I'm going to explain yeah. that one more time because it's so poignant what you're saying. With yeah, yeah. So it, a, real, a lot of it just, it, you know, kind of follows his life and, and just, you know, some of my insecurities and just him growing up black and just giving people a different perspective mm -hmm. of, of what that encompasses. So, Rashad, are you from here? No, I'm from Bloomington, Illinois. Bloomington, Illinois. Yeah. But you're going to be featuring your work that people can buy then? Of course, yes. I love yeah. that. Purchasing, okay. yes. So powerful. <laughs> Are we coming over here now? Yeah, let's do it. All okay, right. is this Thank your you. work? Yes, sir. Okay, Rusty, Rusty, come on over. Oh, right over okay. here. You, you explain this beautiful piece to us. Oh, well, um, it's a landscape, it's a deep pond. <laughs> it's sort of uh, from a place that's uh, my hometown, mm -hmm. Shannon County. Uh, and Shannon County, Missouri? Yes. Okay, what town is this close to? It's Winona. Winona, yeah. gotcha. It's live, beautiful. I live north of here now, though, but that's where I grew up at. That is gorgeous. Thank you so much. Is this, um, is this oil paint? It is oil okay. on canvas. That is beautiful. Does it take a long time to dry? I've never worked with oils. They can. Can. Yeah, yeah. 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 especially if you paint thick like I do sometimes. It takes a, <laughs> it takes a bit. Mm -hmm. Do you have yeah. to do layers? I do. Okay. Yeah. Now, this is considered abstract? Well, it, um, it is not abstract. It has abstraction, but mm -hmm. I guess it's probably not exactly abstract because, I mean, you know, it's screens. beautiful. It's hard Thank for you. me to see it all really from I know. I need to step, uh, I need we're, to step we're back and look at it. I'm too close here. to it. We have a lot of folks. It's all about perspective, it. right? Well, yeah, absolutely. Right. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful. Thank you. Now, will you, uh, you be selling some art, or will you just have people go to your website or that sort of thing? Uh, we sell an art there, and as well, website. Okay. I'm open for whatever. You're open. Yeah. Okay, very good. I, I've noticed that artists are very soft-spoken. Yeah. <laughs> they just, they create, that's what they, they express themselves on canvas or in their art. Absolutely, absolutely. And, and I love that. No, and it's so beautiful. This is my color scheme right yeah. here. I'm going to move back in. Yes, get on in here. So, yeah. Okay. Get on in here. There we and go. then, Come on. Uh, Heidi, you. you have some art as well over I here do. that the bottom one is calling my name too. Yes, it's I gorgeous. love it. Tell us about these. So I um, am a fashion de designer by trade, but um, I moved to contemporary art um, in 2000. 18 and started working with encaustic which is wax hot wax um, and then uh, took some classes and uh, started I'm a I work in illustrator so I work uh, digitally so these are digital um, creations that I have um, sometimes I take the photograph and manipulate and then I use the wax to adhere it to the board and then there's also a stitching element to this top one um, because that's what I do. I stitch <laughs> and uh, a lot of hand stitching details and things like that. So wow. I would love to see the process of yeah. this, this wax. It's pretty doing. fun, but pretty maddening at the same time because, you know, the wax does what it wants to do. True. So, it's yeah. not as fluid as paint. Right. Interesting. Right. right. Did you actually stitch the canvas? Uh, so it's a digital print and then I backed it and I did stitch it. Yes. Wow. With a, a needle. Okay, right. so it wasn't in the frame. So, uh, what is the canvas made of? So this is um, this is just a Japanese paper, and then I backed it with like an interfacing. If, okay. If you know terms of sewing. Yeah, interfacing. And, I interfacing. do know. Okay, interfacing. and then um, and then I sewed through it, mm -hmm. and then I put wax over it, and then I put the wax on the board, and then I used a heat gun and I attached it to it. Oh, that's so, so cool. Can I ask, do you name your pieces? Can I ask you mm -hmm. the names of the pieces? Sure. Because I, then I want to interpret it myself. Okay. Because okay. art is for interpretation, correct? Right. right. Okay. Right. Okay, so this is Pond Life. Makes yes, sense. I was going to say Koi Pond. I was going to say Kind of a blur yeah. reference, mm -hmm. if anybody knows blur. And then this one is Bedford Avenue uh, Flower Shop. I lived on Bedford Avenue in Brooklyn, New York. Oh, there was a that's why that thing. Flower Can, Shop. Okay, okay, <laughs> this is freaking me out. I did not know that. <laughs> okay. You know I was going to name that one? What? Hot Summer in the 70s, New York. There you go. Yeah, that's yeah, Isn't that amazing? Yeah, I really, that's well, what I feel when I see it. Yeah, the, the fire escape. Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah. That is beautiful. Gosh, thank you. So now, much. is that one for sale or is yes. that your baby? Oh, no, it's okay. all for sale. You know what? <laughs> Good question, Wouldn't that be That's hard to no detach from a certain project? <laughs> it, it can be, for sure. There are certain ones that don't get to be for sale, but this one. You bet. That is, take this that is and enjoy gorgeous. It. I yeah. love it. And by the way, too, before we're going to get to Randy's here, but do you do commission work? Yes. Okay. Okay. Yes. Commission? Yes. Just a lot of people, that. you know, have certain things oh, they yeah. want for a certain <laughs> yes. space. Yes. Yeah. Even yes. photographs, right? Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. If you make me look as good as this. Now, <laughs> Randy's well known. What did you bring for us, Randy? We'll bring some oh. of these to the forefront. I'm going to actually hold if yes. it's okay. Randy's you know, I, I just brought a, a couple of my friends from an ongoing series that I've been doing now for seven years. You got it. And it's uh, on individuals from our homeless community. And uh, these particular pieces were on exhibit uh, about three years ago at the Springfield Art Museum, which mm -hmm. they, they produced that show, and they haven't been seen since here in Springfield. And so I'm going to have up a small selection of about 20 pieces of these at the show. So, wow. And I, and I always get their stories, so you, you can see the visual of this person and hopefully be magnetically drawn into them, but then you can read a little bit about their life. Wow. You know, what's interesting is a person in this condition that they are willing to let you mm -hmm. open themselves photograph up. Yeah. them, and, 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 and you can Absolutely. tell, you can see how charismatic, I mean, you can see in the their emotion. eyes. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's so what it much. is, the emotion. You the can emotion. see it yeah. Yeah. in their faces. Yes. Is that hard to capture as an artist? It's something I thrive on, first mm -hmm. and foremost. I, I seriously love authenticity in, mm -hmm. in my work, and so that's my kind of my goal. And But for each person, it's different. Mm -hmm. Each person is different. So the way that I can get that emotion from people will vary quite a bit. Do you have to talk to them a lot during this, the sitting? Oh, like, do you, do oh, you talk yeah. about things and to bring that emotion to their face? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I really try to create a situation where when the shoot's over, I truly feel like a friend just left. Amen. Mm. That's that, great. That we that we got that so close, good. and that there's a trust that's that's yeah. formed, mm -hmm. uh, where then they're like, hey, I know there's a camera in front of my face, but yet this is me. Yeah. This is me. Yes. Yeah, that's wonderful. Okay, this event, guys, is happening this weekend on Sunday at C Sunday. Street uh, from 1 to 4. You don't want to miss this, guys. Thank no. you for putting it together, and thank you to all of you I mean, artists Rusty, that have come along. Rashad, Rusty, Rashad, Heidi, Randy, thank yes. you so much for bringing your art. Thank you. I feel more educated. I feel more yeah. um, fancy now, like I know something about yeah. art. You got it. Yeah, thank you guys so much. <laughs> thank you. We'll be Thanks. back, guys, right after this. So be All of it is so oh, beautiful. It's beautiful. It's just, yes. See, but I feel like I can...